family. So I went, it's year round. And she said, you know, I don't know what you think about this, but you know, can I come over? Can I, can I have Thanksgiving with you? Now, the thing is that in DBT, the first of all, the, the, the short answer to that is very easy. Of course it's not. No, no. So I'm, I'm not going to a funny place with it. But what's really important is, is to not invalidate her interest in doing it. I mean, that was a, actually a really legitimate question. She, doesn't, she didn't have years of training as a therapist. You know, why would she not think that? You know, uh, I'm sure we have, you know, she's a woman was fairly poor. I'm sure we had better food uh, than she was gonna have. Uh, we like each other. It's probably gonna be a pretty pleasant atmosphere. Uh, she didn't really have any, but she's gonna be alone. You know, so this, from her perspective, this was a, a good idea. It's just, there are reasons why it wouldn't be a good idea, but I, I validated her like this. And that helped her problem solve an alternative that didn't involve what wouldn't have been within my limits and wouldn't have been within my role, even if it was my limits, if that makes sense. I think that's important. I can remember early on in my career, <clears throat> a patient asked me where I was going for my vacation, and I, I told them, and my supervisor was all over me about that because my supervisor felt that when my patient asked me where I was going on my vacation, I should have asked him why they wanted to know. And I thought, now that really is dope in my mind. I mean, it's a simple question, let's answer it and move on rather than tell me why you want to know where I'm going on vacation. That's just part of being a fellow human being. Yeah. Sometimes we think uh, the patients also read the ethics guidelines and they memorize them and they know they should know, which is absurd. And, and what they do, they, they, they relate to us and really basically the ones that understand, we listen, we, we, you know, we pay attention and, and of course they like us. And every other relationship they have that they, where they like the person, uh, be it their, their hairdresser or the neighbor, well, they do stuff like that. They, they, you know, invite each other to their houses and stuff. So it's, they're doing what they do, normal. Thank you. Gracias. Uh-huh. <laughs> what, what's your rating now? <laughs> He's happy. Yes, I'm happy. I am happy. Joy and fun. Roma? So that's it. Perfect. Gracias. Bueno, pues, eh, thank you, uh, all of the presenters. We are very happy. Yes, falta um, poquito. We are very happy to have you here, uh, to have you here today. Um, para nosotros ha sido una experiencia maravillosa. Eh, queremos también agradecerle a ustedes, de parte de todo el equipo de BT, el momento en el que esta idea surgió, the moment this idea uh, emerged. Um, some of us were uh, like present in that uh, training, and well, we were present, not like present. <laughs> we were present, um, and Mr. Um, Dr. Domingo started uh, these and it is uh, like a real dream come true yeah, for the university and, and for all of the DVT team so we want to thank you uh, a ustedes los profesionales los que de, de alguna manera se tomaron el tiempo para llegar hasta aquí y también se interesaron en hacer esto los esperamos también mañana ahora en esto no se termina hoy uh, vamos entonces a pasar a las dentro de 10 minutitos a lo que es el, la actividad de cóctel y el cierre, así que seguimos compartiendo. Gracias. Nuevamente, muchas gracias a todos por su presencia. Ha sido una experiencia muy bonita, ha sido un público maravilloso. Nuestros presentadores también, muchas gracias por, por compartir su experiencia con nosotros en la tarde de hoy. Eh, ahora tendremos un cóctel en el primer piso eh, frente a la universidad y vamos a tener música también amenizando el mismo eh, esperamos que todos puedan disfrutar del mismo mañana finalizamos el simposio ya, eh, cerrando la brecha 
y la conferencia comenzará nuevamente a las 8 y 30 de la mañana. Los esperamos a todos y que pasen una muy linda tarde. Muchas gracias.